to those who were complaining about my piece popping in my videos, I bought the pop filter, I hope you're happy. I know my voice doesn't usually convey emotions properly, but this is all for you guys. So let's talk about artificial intelligence. Deep Blue, Cicero, Deep Mind, Chat GPT. You might think that now I'll start talking about the Skynet and Terminator scenario and AI ruling us and taking over. But no, this is actually a very different video. Facebook's AI Cicero was what inspired me to make this video. Cicero is able to play a strategy game called Diplomacy. This might not sound that impressive, but this strategy game is different from the usual strategy games. This is not like Age of Empires or not like a civilization type of games. To achieve your goals in this game, this game requires you to actually communicate with five different other players. So it's six players total and each player needs to communicate with five other players. They all reveal their goals. They negotiate on how to move, how to make alliances. So in essence, Cicero is able to force you to make moves to achieve its own goals. This is actually a chatbot that talks to you and tries to win you over. This is an AI that's now as good as the best human players in the world. And it's good at persuading players that realize that they're being persuaded. The AI is able to persuade real humans to do things that may not be in their own interest. And it does that by talking to them. Now, here comes the interesting part. You guys can easily spot a bot's comment in YouTube or Facebook or in Google Play. You can realize that this is a fake review, right? Now imagine that you can't do that anymore. Imagine that both human and AI responses are now indistinguishable. Imagine that this video's comments may be filled with actual positive comments that sound like real humans, and you can't even differentiate which ones are real and which ones are AI. Now for this video, it doesn't really matter. But for a product, for a medicine, reviews for a doctor in your area, companies cannot buy the authentic trust that human recommendations bring. But imagine if they can. If you can make bots that look truly, truly human, you can flood comment sections with comments that look very, very authentic. You can actually manufacture organic consensus about your product. Companies would never pay for a hundred random people on the internet to make reviews for their products. But they would pay an AI to do it. If all of that usage of unrestricted AI doesn't terrify you, then here is one more scenario. What if AI was used to swing an election in someone's favor? I'll let you sleep on that.